Ah, uh, the life of luxury. Yes, quite. Oh, this, they're shaped like sea animals. How cute. Oh, yeah. I never noticed that, actually. <laughs> There's a crab and a dolphin and a turtle. I was watching some playthrough of this game a few months ago, and I noticed on the map that the island was shaped like a dolphin. And I was like, how did I never notice that? <laughs> well, I mean, it's called Isle Delfino. Delfino being Italian for dolphin. I didn't. I don't speak Italian. I'm from America. I speak American. American. America. Whoa. You know, I gotta like how they're on a plane that's flying to this island, so their in-flight entertainment is an advertisement from their tourist agency about the island. And also, did yes. they not notice while they were filming this tourist video that there's a Shadow Mario in the background? Maybe it's live. That's true. That's that's even weirder. <laughs> I, <like> a... <laughs> like, I feel you, Mario. Food. Food Mario's life. a hardcore foodie. I, I'm feeling toes of earth right now. <laughs> now, now life. Pete, Pete's just like these idiots. Oh god. Why didn't I bring Daisy and Rosalina with me? Rosalina's too busy being a space goddess. That's true. Rosalina wasn't even born yet. Which probably was. Well, well exist. Well, in the Mario universe. It's Super Mario Sunshine. Hey, welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. I am Maestro. And today, we are joined by two of my very good friends. I'm Nebbles. And I'm Martian Media. And, uh, Mario's just kind of showing off the options, because no Let's Play is complete without showing off the options. <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. Mm. Dude, 120 <laughs> shines? We already beat the game. Sweet. <laughs> You stole my joke! Fuck you! Oh, cutscene. Ugh, oh, cutscenes. In, in a Mario game. This <laughs> Was this like the first Mario game to have like actual cutscenes? I think so, yeah. Probably. Well, like, Super Mario 64 it, this is the that. first Mario game to do a lot of things though, so. That's true. Super Mario 64 well, did like... have that like little thing at the beginning, kind of, where Lucky 2 had the little camera going around the place. But yeah, does that really count? But that was more. No, I, I want to count that more as Nintendo showing off. Look, like, ooh, Mario in look. 3D! Look, blocks! Moving! Now, now, boys! Don't it's moving! <laughs> Mama! I can't, I can't, I can't <laughs> do a toad voice. No, not many people have that ability. Peach's little <laughs> drug binge on the plane is starting to have an effect. It, it's that jet lag. Oh. She's like, oh my god. She's, she saw some sort of shadowy man. <laughs> and subtitles, like, they never did this again, I don't think, right? No, nope. no, I'm pretty sure Galaxy had an option for subtitles. Well, like... I mean, well, I mean well, that's kind of a standard spoken. thing in games, though. Yeah. And we're gonna promptly run away from the situation. Yes! Sounds, sounds not good. <laughs> Mario, the hero! He's like, I'm out. Later. It's gotta run away from your responsibilities. He's like, oh hey, what's going on here? Alright, so right off the bat, uh, y comparing this to the previous entry in the Mario series, uh, Super Mario 64, you notice Mario moves a bit differently. Right into the goop. Uh-huh. Uh, you remember the momentum physics He's from so uh, 64, right? Vaguely, yes. Uh, imagine that no. jacked up a thousand percent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For sure. I remember being very frustrated with the momentum in this game. Yeah, yeah it, 60, uh. it, uh, mm. well, <laughs> I have a very good demonstration of why it causes problems a little later on in the video. But oh, for right fun. now, we're just kind of getting a feel for the thing. This is the, the world map, which you will never need, ever. <laughs> How did I- Who uses a world map in a How did I game not notice this for... was a dolphin? Oh my god. <laughs> Cause you're a filthy casual, that's why. I was probably like six, so... Exactly! A filthy that's casual. no excuse! True. I need to set my six-year-old game up. <laughs> yeah, you gotta get good. Get good, scrub. This guy's freaking out! Yeah! Ah! Rawr! Look at that mustache! <laughs> yeah. I love the noises these, these things make. Yeah. 
Fun fact, uh, I do believe that Charles Martinet did most of the voices for the Piantas in this game. Didn't he, doesn't he do like... I wouldn't doubt it. Everything, though, in Mario. Eh, he's probably the most uh, used voice actor, but now we're meeting our uh, primary game mechanic. This item from Gab Science Incorporated. <laughs> to uh, well, then again, I, I have a friend who does, who does play a really good Mario and uses Flood, but I still think Flood could could be a place. I like how in like, like the little data screen that shows up, they had little um, snippets of older Mario games. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Was that, that cool. That, that, that was. That's, I always thought that was a nice touch. Yeah. That was a nice touch. Behold, tutorials. Yay. I love forced tutor tutorials in video games. Ugh. And then when they do that little thing at the end, where it's all like, "Did you get all that?" and they highlight no to start off, so you accidentally press no, and you have to watch the whole stupid thing again. <laughs> it's like getting stuck in the endless, endless loop. At the, do you at the mind? I'm trying center. to take notes here. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh, all right. I didn't know you. you sorry, you didn't know how to play Super Mario Sunshine. Uh, oh no! This thing could get empty. What do I do? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, look at that shiny water. So pretty. The water looks gorgeous in this game. This game is so pretty. That is some. And it's like super yeah. relaxing. Okay. I, I missed like half of that. Can we go back? No. Uh, Don't. Okay, fine. I swear to God, I'm gonna beat you. <laughs> No, this game is like so pretty and the scenery is all so relaxing, which completely yeah. offsets how freaking frustrating this game is. Yeah, yeah. It, it's not so much like this game is hard, it's just frustrating. The physics, like you said, it's just like, ugh. Yeah, like, I really, I, like, Mario games are never really hard, they're frustrating. That's well, what I'm even. Like, it's only this one, though. Uh, all the other Mario games, you know, they behave like you think they should as a Mario game. Yeah. Well, Galaxy has. Well, well, yeah, yeah. Galaxy be behaves how you would, would expect, but it, I've had my fair share of frustration in that game. Yeah, but I think that was just more to questionable mechanics than it was just trying to play the game. You already messed up. Can we just go back to this right now? <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. You, I, I, you little drunk there. You doing yeah, all right? Yeah, I'm just trying to doing all right. kind of showing off. Is that vodka instead of water? Like all of the ways milk. Mario has of moving. I will say this: I love this game a lot for that ridiculous spin jump he's got. Because mm -hmm. you can get some insane height off of that. Yeah. And which is good because it mitigates the fact that you don't have a backflip in this game. Yeah. Well, what about like the thing where you kind of? Oh, I think I get what you're talking about. I was ta I was thinking about the thing where you like go backwards on the stick and then press A and he does like a little flippy flip in the air. Yeah, he does a he has got a pretty good side flip too. Also, he can get some pretty good height off of the uh, <laughs> inhabitants. <laughs> locals are made out of I don't think home. they're going to be very happy. Our first to keep enemy jumping on their and head. most recurring enemy in the game. Yay. The goopy piranha. You spray water in its mouth. Mm -hmm. So intuitive. Don't forget the rule of three. Oh, uh, well, Nintendo loves their rule of three. Who doesn't love the rule of three, though, let's be honest. <laughs> True. Three is a magic number. Shout out yes, to Schoolhouse is. Rock. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, what's that? It's a shiny thing. Oh, shiny. Oh, oh I get it. I see what you did there. It's not, but it's not a star. I'm not sure if I want it. Ew. But it's shiny! Yeah, grab it. I like how I was able to actually spray the toads in the background. Oh, yeah. I did good, Peach, right? Did I do right? it? Did I do good? Peach is also just distracted by the shiny. They're all distracted by the shiny things. But it's a shiny thing. Why wouldn't you be, why wouldn't you be distracted? Also, fun fact. Uh, I'd like to think of these guys oh. as... The very young version of the modern Toad Brigade. They had the I exact like same idea. color scheme. Oh, yeah. That's actually a keen observation. I like that. Yeah, they do have the same colors. Isn't there a blue one, though? Yeah, but he's yeah. standing elsewhere. Yahoo! Shine Git! First shine Yahoo! of the game! Get the 119 more than you! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Why
Good job. You did it. Oh, by the way, more cutscene. Mmm. Blood. For some reason, I can talk out of my nozzle. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, now it's the buzz! Run! Run! <laughs> just about to say. <laughs> I'm innocent, I swear! I didn't do anything! He's just like, well, I guess. <laughs> I guess I'm going to jail now. Fuck now. Hold on, this, this, Phoenix this, right right here. This is probably the best best courtroom scene I have ever seen in any yeah. form of media. Like the background is just so good. And yes, endangering our very way. Also, I indeed the thing about this game. I didn't realize the prosecutor was going to be Al Gore, guys. Yeah. <laughs> the thing I never got about this game is like. How could they ever confuse Mario with whoever it was? Because fucking, he stupid. just landed on the plane like five seconds. But ago. they both have mustaches. They both have mustaches and caps and junk. But he is also not made of weird blue goop. Obvious. Well, well they're they're he colorblind. Behold this sketch of the perpetrator. Also, Mario doesn't have weird shadow white eyes. It is obvious the guilty party sits among us. It is none other than Mario. Objection. Hey, you're not Phoenix, right? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, I just love that. Princess Objection. Peach, well-known monarch in this world, has no power in a court of law. Yeah. It's great. Peach is the worst <laughs> lawyer. Poor Peach, no. Peach goes, Objection. It's like, you're not Phoenix, right? Overruled. <laughs> You know, never mind the fact that this could probably be ve solved very quickly by Peach claiming Mario has diplomatic immunity for being an ambassador from the Mushroom Kingdom. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I guess. Bam! <laughs> this blue is right wide open. Oh, my brain can't handle this truth bomb. <laughs> Mario politics are very intense. Ah. It's just like the Mario Cold War between the Mushroom Kingdom and Isle Delfino. <laughs> That's my favorite part of the Mario the, the, This entire line. game is basically, you know, the whole uh, Cuban Missile Crisis <laughs> of the Mario <laughs> world, of course. What a deep political message. Oh my goodness. Well, I mean, it's got the whole environmental thing going on already. Yeah, true, true. Even as we speak. And instead and this of is still going. Missiles, it's paint. Because that's totally harmful. I love how they basically resolved, like, well, we're fucked, but we might as well try and make it work. Yeah. yeah let's listen to it again. No. Uh -huh. <laughs> Gave me the best pain. <laughs> then I might as well get rid of you. Oh. This guy sounds like, um,. The piggy bank from Toy Story, kind of. Maybe. He does, a little bit. Eh. Delfino Plaza. Yay! Your adventure awaits you. <laughs> this isn't Iowa State. Oh, I love Delfino Isles music. Okay. This is what makes ah. one pick up a ukulele and just. Aggressively play the ukulele. Just, just play the song wherever I go. Maybe if I play, the, maybe if I had to learn to play this song on on the piano or something, it'll bring the summer. And it'll stop being February. Please. I don't know. It's not very summer right now. Look at all the shadow. It's true. But there's no snow or ice or cold. And nobody's complaining about it being cold. Yeah. All right. Let's let's talk to Peach. Okay. Cause she's not kidnapped for once. <laughs> Yet. Why does she have a parasol out? There's no sun. Cause it's fashionable, yeah. okay? True. She's not As a, a lady princess of, of practicality. She's a princess of pretty, okay? <laughs> princess of pretty. <laughs> <All right. laughs> but I thought I was a princess of pretty. You can be whatever you want. But Princess Peach is the premier princess of pretty. That is true. Prim and proper, in fact. <laughs> Prim, proper, All premier right. princess of pretty. How about that? Yeah, that's it. Well, I was gonna say, you should probably go clean up that goop. There. Ah, if I have to. Ugh. Making me do Some vacation. 
<laughs> yeah, you, you go on a vacation and you have to do community servers. What kind of bullshit is this? I just always think about how once Mario finishes and they kind of like start their vacation, how he's just he has to have like some sort of PTSD about the whole thing. Like he'll go to Bianco Hills and he'll see like a flower or something, and he'll be like, "Oh god!" And he just have a giant flashback to <laughs> he'll just like fall on the ground and start seizing. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he can never walk me through an art, art store ever again. <laughs> he can't oh sign God. his name without the thinking paint, about that. The paint, man! The paint! He can never talk about Mario Paint. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he can never sign his name without thinking about the M that's just scribbled everywhere. <laughs> Yay, another goofy poop. Cause we haven't seen one of these before. No, it's not like... And it even comes in, the, and now it comes in the lovely color, uh, lovely color of shit brown. Yeah, my favorite. It, it's chocolate, okay? Oh, shit. Chocolate. Okay. Oh, sugar coated. It is shit. Cutscene. <laughs> it's like what the? No. Uh, Correct me if I'm wrong here, but I think it's a little weird for buildings to, um, you know, just. Instantly come out of the ground like that. Oh my god, you beat me to it. I was gonna say that once we got to the part where the lighthouse is just gone, and it's like, where does the lighthouse go? It's like a 50 foot tall building, and whoa, it just whoa, disappears whoa, whoa, whoa. under me. No spoilers! I mean. Oh no, Peach has been kidnapped! Oh, what a surprise. Peach has been kidnapped! How are you surprised <laughs> at this point? Go get her. I gotta get Peach! <laughs> ah! I gotta Peach! Go. Oh! Gotta save the princess! Gotta save the princess by spraying some yeah. dirty water, cause that's exactly Big Egg and Peach! Peach, I'm coming! I'm coming, Peach! I'm getting- uh, I'm getting- I'm getting you! I'm getting- Ah! Oh, jeez. Now, Peach! I'm coming! I'm coming! Oh! Ugh, <laughs> uh, you blew it. Oh my god. Yeah, bl rip. Rip to shreds. Peach! Oh no! You're doing a very bad job. You're not doing a very good job at your job. Oh god! Yeah, blah blah. Don't do it. Blah 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 blah. You shouldn't be allowed to use water. Oh no, he's getting away! Quick! Take him down! How's it feel? We gotta get! He's gonna get stepped on. And. Oh. 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 How did he pay that M? It looks like he was a mayor. On the um, on the uh. He's got really good penmanship. Go get him. All right. Oh no, we gotta go after him. him. Quick, quick, turn into, into the painting. Quick, turn into atoms. <laughs> and we gotta go. Hurry up. Ah! 